at this final tournament of the 2015 season, the Castaneda Resort uh, Pro Golf Tour Championship. Robin Kent is here uh, in front of the clubhouse, and after 36 holes, you still have a very good chance, Robin, to make it into the top five of the final ranking. Yes, uh, I have to finish uh, finish strong tomorrow, so uh, I know what I uh, what I have to do, and uh, yeah, just uh, make the best out of it. Yeah. You have a very good and solid season so far and you have a really exceptional win a few weeks ago in uh, Bochum when you also shot around a 59. Did that change a little bit of your life? Uh, no, not really. It's uh, only one round and uh, uh, no, it gave me uh, some confidence but uh, no, it doesn't change uh, that much now. But at least this win there in Bochum brought you into the position at all to make it into the top five. And now you had a very uh, interesting two days here, uh, competing directly against the actual number five, uh, Timo Bakker. So how does it feel? Uh, no, I'm, I'm not looking at him, uh, what, uh, what he's doing. I'm just trying to win the tournament. And uh, uh, if I'm uh, uh, finished second, I'm still disappointed that I'm uh, not uh, winning the tournament. So uh, I'm not uh, looking... Uh, uh, at uh, somebody else's game, only only my game, and uh, if I play my uh, my best, uh, that's everything I can do. So, uh. what is the way to play this golf course here successfully? <laughs> I think uh, you have to play the par fives uh, strong. If you uh, have some uh, good tee shots on the par fives, you can uh, create some uh, good uh, chances uh, for birdie and eagle, and. Uh, then uh, the rest of the holes uh, you have to just create some chances and uh, you can uh, shoot a really low number but uh, unfortunately I didn't play the par fives that well so uh, a good score uh, kept me uh, kept me out today yeah yeah you had a round of 73 today so you were not very happy but what do you think you have to change for tomorrow then? what I have to change for yes. tomorrow uh, not much I just uh, have to do the same things and uh, uh, yeah, just have to uh, fall a bit. The greens are really bad, so uh, yeah, it's uh, sometimes more luck. If uh, if you make a good stroke but it doesn't drop, yeah, uh, you c you can't do anything about it. So uh, now I'm just uh, doing the same things, and uh, hopefully uh, it will uh, uh, fall my way uh, tomorrow. And uh, just create uh, create uh, 18 chances, so uh, maybe another 59. <laughs> Yeah, that would be a very, very good plan to do that. You were playing on the Challenge Tour last year. Now you're back on the Pro Golf Tour and f trying to fight your ba way back to the Challenge Tour again. Uh, can you explain uh, in a few words the difference between the two tours? Um, I think the overall players are a little bit uh, better. I think uh, the here around top 30 is uh, pretty good and there maybe uh, top uh, 70. That uh, that are really good. So uh, I think that's the uh, that's the difference. But uh, yeah, the rest uh, it's it's about the same. Uh, on the European tour, it changes a bit. And on the with the courses, the courses are uh, uh, more difficult and more rough. And uh, but Challenge Tour, it's uh, around the same. Pretty open, so uh, you can uh, you can hit it uh, a long way. And uh, and so sometimes. Uh, off of the fairway and you're still uh, in a good position so uh, that uh, that doesn't change that much now. Your brother Richard is with you on the back this week so does it help a lot? Uh, yeah he, uh, he keeps me uh, he keeps me calm and uh, uh, yeah he knows uh, my game uh, yeah, uh, the best and uh, yeah it's just uh, if I uh, if I am not sure about a shot I can ask him and uh, that uh, gives you a little bit more confidence uh, about uh, uh, about some uh, shots. So, uh, yeah, it's good that he's here. Yeah. So all the best for the final round, Robin. Thank you very much and all the best for the rest and for the next season. Yeah, thank you. No problem. Thank you.